Hey guys, what's up? I'm doing another, uh, I guess you could say it's an airsoft review um, of uh, one of my favorite guns, a gun that I've had for a long time that uh, I would recommend anyone getting because this is a pretty solid gun. Um, I know a lot of people buy um, for their sidearms automatic, like little automatic SMGs or um, gas pistols or CO2 pistols. But if you don't, if that's not you, or you don't have the money, or you don't think um, it's a good investment, or if you just, you don't have the money and you want to still get a good gun, but not for so much money, um, you can get this, uh, I think it's uh, HFC or um, UTC, or UHC, I forget what the company makes this gun, I can't remember, I bought it uh, about two years ago, but this is a, this is a spring-loaded pistol and I wow I don't have I gotta find that but um so this pistol is a spring it uh you know talk back fires once shoot um this gun weighs about one pound and for a spring gun this that's really um really good everything in here is plastic in this gun um the magazine which I gotta find Ha, uh, holds about 20, 20 um, rounds, and that's pretty good for a spring gun. Most only hold uh, 12, um, maybe even 15. So uh, this one is the two-tone. They sell it in a silver, and they also sell it in black. It comes with these uh, really nice grips for being plastic. They're pretty, uh, pretty nice. This gun has a safety on it. It has a dual safety mode, actually. There's this safety, which holds it, um, the sliding front uh, slide for moving back and forth and to shoot it there is this uh if i can get it right there this there's a button right here that you push that you have to hold with your palm to be able to pull the trigger um so because see if my hands aren't on it i can't pull the trigger it's not going to fire this gun's cocked but if i hold it there it goes it fires and even the same thing with the f uh hammer cock rack uh, surprisingly for this spring shoots about 250 feet per second with uh, probably 230 with 0.2 uh, gram BBs and it's heavy this gun is a really heavy gun and it's a durable gun I mean, I've dropped it I've um, just I've abused this gun and it still works for me a little shaky a little wobbly um, taking apart this gun is like any other gun you push that button right here slide that down slide it off I can actually do that right now I think Maybe, maybe not. Oh wow, that's really hard. Oh, wow. I forgot how hard to take that thing out. But you slide it off and um, there's your gun. This gun actually, most spring guns have only a one spring system up front. Um, this gun has two, one in the back and one in the front, so it's a little more powerful, a little bit more durable, even though it's all plastic. It, I mean, this gun shoots straight for about, you know, 50 feet, and then it curves, but I mean, that's a spring pistol. You're getting that much distance with a spring pistol. I mean, you can't go wrong. I mean, I've seen other, there are more greater spring pistols I can get for 30, 40 bucks, but I mean, if you're on a $30, $30 limit and you don't want to spend anything with taxes, um, this, this gun is, like, perfect for you. Uh, I'm gonna have a tough time putting that back on. I'm just gonna do that later for now. So, yeah, um, the gun's great. I've had it for a long time. Shoots well, shoots hard. Um, it's just an overall great spring pistol. I would recommend it to anyone. I know it's the 1911, which is also a nice-looking gun. A little bit long, but... Hey, it works, it shoots, it still, it's great. I love it. I mean, I'd take that, I'd take that any day over a gas uh, pistol, even though I do have one. I mean, if I couldn't use my gas one, hands down, I would take that than anything else. So, um, like the video, subscribe, comment if uh, you, uh, I could probably give you a link or anything if you want uh, where you can find that gun. Um, it's just a great overall pistol. I love it so much. Um, so, uh, like I said, like, comment, subscribe, uh, 
you know, give me a heads up. Uh, any uh, criticism would be nice. I'd just like to know if I need to do anything better, need to do anything worse, etc., etc. I explain that in a lot of my videos. I just try to, try, I'm just trying to learn how to do better videos for you guys. So, uh, yeah. Um, peace.